So um, at this point, I'm going to hand it off to, uh, to our host for the day. Um, it's, a, it's a real blast. It's something that's also a first. It's not going to be just all me all day. Uh, we have uh, a number of outstanding uh, students that work with us. And for the past year, uh, Krista Schaefer has been an, an amazing, probably the strongest and most active student volunteer that we've had. Um, pretty steadily throughout. But she's also very busy because she's an IB student, full-time IB student, which requires lots of, of extra time spent on volunteer activities. Uh, she's the director of this year's showcases. Um, she also helped us with an accompaniment at Solo Ensemble, earned some uh, volunteer credit for that. And uh, she, in her own way, works outstandingly with the kids, with the junior high kids. Does a great job with them. And you'll see her performing next week in the showcase if you come back, both as an accompanist and a piano soloist and a violin soloist. Uh, so um, it's my, my honor to introduce one of Dexter's finest high school students from the uh, junior class, Ms. Krista Schaefer. Daniel Hanrath here with us today in the back. He is a Dexter grad from the year 2012, and he's studying music at um, education at Central. And he's going to be providing the performers with some written comments so that they can be even more prepared when they play at States. Um, so thank you, Dan. Thank you for coming. We are very happy.
Scott Clipper, who's running the cameras in the back, welcome to your first event. <laughs> and uh, in the back, there's a dedication. Um, where is there? To my oh yeah, the extra yep. to my parents who are also present. Richard and Martha Dar. Literally, um, if we ever have a facility, uh, there's a couple of people in here that may have a wing named after them, and there there are two of them, Richard and Martha Dar, who are here. possibly feel like um, the Wright brothers' dad before they invented anything that <laughs> was of value. And then, um, uh, let's do the other thing. Oh, you noticed inside I've got a little ad here for Brian's service, a uh, bit of crass commercialism, right? Well, what I've decided to do is um, we, we, we needed to kind of fill out this full program when we had the idea of doing an insert. And, um, and I was wondering about doing sponsorships, and we kind of thought we didn't really want to do that, not for a program like this. It should just be all about letting the kids perform. And, um, but we, but uh, now Brian is, there is a, there is a family resemblance to the last name. Uh, he is my nephew, 
um, which made them highly available and uh, ready to get something in this program. So the idea is that if any of the students in Dexter uh, or uh, that we work with want to put an ad in any of our programs for babysitting uh, or whatever they do, or tutoring or whatever it may be, or even lessons, um, we're going to let them do that free of charge as long as they're active in our programs. And so Brian has been another active volunteer for the past year. He's also, I think, going to be, going to be playing next week in the program. He's a sax player in the symphonic band. So guys, think about that, okay? Uh, and, uh, and I can tell you, he, he does great work, and he, um, uh, his goal is to keep the cost below the competition and to do outstanding work. So if you need yard work done or even stone removal, here's your information right here. And then finally, um, oh, not oh, second to last, the Rising Stars, we are recruiting sixth graders now. Uh, we want to have 40 sixth graders signed up this year, which will double the size that it was last year. I, I'm working with some college students that will help us out and do more, more of a compliment stuff and working with the kids. So uh, if you know sixth graders, encourage them to contact us. Um, oh, and the final thing is just a reminder that all the students performing here today received a one at district. It's mostly for the high school kids to get some, some practice ahead of going to state. Okay? Everyone here received a, a superior rating at the district festival. Um, and then we invited the junior high kids to come just as a great experience. And, and we want to hear them play too. So uh, this is so that they don't only play for judges, they get to play for the community for parents. So I hope you enjoy it so far. And with that, I'm going to turn it back after the shaker. Okay, so up next we have Caleb Turk, who is going to be playing Lever Mabachi, which is by Rimsky Korskov. So, open the
libretto by Paul Kotke. Um, right? Is, right? Is that right? Okay. Sorry. Oh, wait, do we have another? Yeah. Is that correct?
have Emily Santunian, who is going to be playing concerto number five in D major by sites. So. <laughs> well, let's, uh, let's go back to um, Connor. Oh, did we not do Connor? No. <laughs> We need Connor and then Benny, yeah. Oh, okay. Let's do Megan, yes. That's okay. That's okay. Okay, Megan, um, Megan Friedman, 9 3 flute. She's going to be playing on Dante for flute and piano and some major by Mozart.
Johnson, who is going to be playing Cleopatra's Lament by Handel.
really excites me because she's going to be representing the orchestra. Yes, orchestra. We have a lot of band kids here today. I'm in the orchestra, so this makes me happy. All right, um, she's Emily Zaitunian, and she's going to be playing concerto with D major, five sets. So,
because he is also an alumni from Dexter. He composed this piece called Letting Go with a Friend, which is, that's pretty cool to compose your own piece. All right, he's a Dexter High School grad from um, 03, and he was um, in the drama club. And he is now, uh, he got his bachelor's in Spring Arbor and um, took a music minor in guitar and harp. So welcome on stage. Uh, I just want to say thanks for having me. And uh, it's, it's great to see the, the wonderful music program in Dexter that uh, just keep going. I was so glad to be a part of myself.
Um, and I think it's going to be even bigger than this one. Uh, so there's that. And there are lots of refreshments back there waiting to be eaten. So you guys can head on back there when you're ready. Thank you all for coming. It's really good. Nice Thanks again. Also, there's Amber Ratliff, who also has been involved in helping. She's not here today, but she created these programs. You should see her next week. She's a college intern from, the, uh, from Eastern, who is volunteering her time to help us out. Um, and um, I want the students, don't, don't run off. If, you know, I want to get a picture of everyone at some point. Probably do that next before you guys get refreshments. And uh, Krista, thank you very much for all your work. Let's get some pictures and everyone else enjoy the refreshment. <laughs> yeah, let's have, let's have the instruments. If you still have them out. Anybody else? Yeah. Oh, there's someone. 